Hello YouTube and welcome to episode 4 of Dark Sun the Shattered Lands. We're in this area here fighting these uh, free uh, fire elementals for like the third time. Um, that's the reason it's been taking so long for me to get the next episode on. I've encountered um, a few small game-breaking glitches in the last two times I've tried to upload this and today let's hope that things go our way uh, I don't know any hermits get out of here the hermit said you drove him off I if I were you I just get out of here. That hermit is lying to you. How do you know the hermit's lying? Look, you have to trust me. This hermit is a defiler. Those fire elementals are under his control. He drove the We drove him off so he couldn't keep summoning them. Now leave. All right. Now we go talk to the hermit again. Oh, come on. Don't give me that. A fire elemental will burn me to death if you don't get rid of those marauder murderers. I know one will. The ranger says you're a defiler. He's lying. He is the defiler. He has sent his elemental to kill me, so I won't be in the way while they loot the ruins. Why don't more elementals attack you? The bandits command him. They taunt me day after day. I never know when they will strike. You must help me. Why haven't you simply left the region? I found those ruins, and I'm not about to give up on them. Elemental or not, I'm staying, even if it means my life. You're too cowardly to have such conviction. Fine, I've had enough of your questioning and accusations. Leave before... Just leave. And now a fire elemental's gonna come over here. I think he's going to say the same thing. Yep. So. Die. Yeah, see? See? He's, he's a bad guy. One bad guy. Um. I haven't. Got. Let's see. What if... Dang, all of my spells are fire spells. I wonder if Minute Meteor works. Oh yeah, okay. That did just fine. 4,000 experience. Save Mistra! Let's see, I can't cast that again, so... We'll go with a magic missile. Super! And he's got a necklace that launches fireballs. So, we'll just put that there drop that because it's worthless we need to organize this for sure again I apologize for my cat in the background. He wants to go outside, but I am busy and can't let him outside right now. 
So he's got six. So two more boxes, three more boxes, and then no more boxes. Six for each character is enough to carry everything I'll need. In the next area, we'll encounter a bunch of Thrykreen, and we've got to pick up seven stones. So that we can get the meteorite. Stop it! Stop it! Stop! Come on, guy. Guard. Guard. There we go. Oh, I forgot to pick up the rock. Rock there. Rock there. Rock y'all. I think there's two more rocks. Rock there. And rock here. And then to the geyser. Let's get this one first. 
we got to figure out. Oh, first try. First try. Last rock. First try. <laughs> and then I want lightning bolt. Get my meteorite and let's get the HE double hockey sticks out of here. Yes, please. All right. Um, he's still following that for now. And that's that. So let's go to to Quezzle. and use our meteorite. All right, what's on the map? We got some fire eels and some blue slod, nice. Let's rest before we go to the fire rails. I don't want to risk anyone dying yet. Pretty sure I can resurrect people in the healing room in um, Balzac's uh, area. But I cannot remember for sure, and I'm not really wanting to go there just yet. The next area I want to do is the mountain. Gained a level. Okay. This guy. Now we're going to come over here and make our meteor into an axe. And then, okay. 
So let's get rid of those. While the blind is somewhat useful, I'd like to do a lot more damage. Oh goody, we've got more fights. Blink dogs. Sand towers. Uh, I always forget what things are called. Let's get behind this guy. What's going? Wow, they aggroed me from all the way down there? That's crazy. Oh, excuse me. Yep, let's go. Oh, good. My tribe has arrived. I've received my vision shortly after you left. They are out hunting for food. You are welcome to stay here with me, Al. You are not prey. Tell me of your vision. I saw my tribe growing here. I saw your pack amongst my fleshlings. You waded through the slaughter of war. The lines of city men faded and bothered my tribe no more. Why am I not prey? My vision shows that you will hinder the city. My tribesmen shall benefit from one fewer threat. For this, I make you exempt from the hunt. Do you have any interesting news? We interact with few outside the tribe. I can provide nothing of interest. So you will help me? I can do no more than make you not prey. I do not send my people into the organized slaughter war. Return and see my tribe grow. May you always find prey. When we head back towards to Quetzal, there'll be another part of that to do. Run, the wyverns, the wyverns, run for your lives. We gotta get these wyverns. Let's kill this guy before he attacks. Hey, don't do that. How dare you! Never come near me and my son again. Thank you for saving us. You are great warriors to drive off the Wyvern Raiders. Our leader will want to meet you. Who is your leader? She is the great is in the great house on the north side of the village. Will I will lead you there if you wish. No thanks. Why do the Wyverns attack your village? The bandits who ride them come to take our food and whatever else they can find. They've already taken everything we had, though I don't know why they keep returning, unless they just enjoy killing. 
All right, goodbye. Next, we're going to come here. This guy. He's going to be like, halt, go no further, and I'm just going to not listen. He has stuff to say if I talk to him, but it's not very important. Now, I'm not sure there's anything I can do with that. I've never found a use for it, and um, a quick Google search will show you that nobody else has either. Get the box. Use the book. Get the spells. Personal entry. I love Tristram like no other. I cannot live without her. Though she is my pupil, she is also my equal. I fear that her father may suspect that she has feelings toward me. <sighs> Calamity! A priest, Apos, from the southern kingdom has cursed, caused my enormous, an enormous earthquake, which all but engulfed our temple. Necromantic spells are brewing, I fear. Long in preparation, these curses will be impossible to deflect. Alright, thanks. So, I think this is... Hold on dead. Okay, learn that. What's in the box? Jack. Jack's in the box. And there's nothing else to get here. So we're just going to leave. Where are you going? All right, let's go talk to the lady in charge. I'm Ch Chaya, the village leader. I demand to know your business here. Are you oppressors like the bandits or worse? Oh, you sticky fingers. I don't care what your name is. It's probably false anyway. I want to know why you're here. Um, I seek allies. I won't ally with rabble like you. No doubt you intend to lure our warriors away so you can return and take control of the village. How do I prove my intentions are peaceful? You look no different than the bandits who constantly raid my village. Stealing and killing, prove yourself better than them and I might talk to you. I'll get rid of those bandits. I certainly don't object to you getting rid of the bandits, but don't expect anything in return. That's enough for me. You surprised me. I had not thought to see such selfless heroism anywhere on Athos. Perhaps you would take the chest hidden under my bed in an atonement for my reading. Ugh. I could use a place to rest. It's the least I can do. You may stay here as long as you wish. Alright, thanks. Goodbye. 500 experience. Frickin' worthless. Oh, poopy head. There we go. And that's six. And a plus two sling. Drop the bow. Sleep at the campfire. And down here. Oh, I forgot to ask her. I'm Sticky Fingers. Can you help me against the bandits? Please, I won't take much of your time. Do you know if I can climb to the castle? Where's the cave opening? Will you show me the cave opening? Thank you for your help. Alright. 
I should have read that to you guys, but, um... Uh, 500 experience. Yes, please. There's some screamer beetles gonna come and try to fight me. Nothing there. It looked like that snake just came out of that guy's, that screamer beetle's mouth. Hello. What are you cutthroats doing this far from your castle? I'm warning you, I have friends among the dark spiders. Um, I mean you no harm. Then you are not from the castle. I am relieved to hear that. You know, folk, you worry about me. Excuse me, have enough troubles without bandits terrorizing them. Can you help me into the castle? The castle is evil. I advise you stay as far away as possible. Why are you here alone? I am the outcast because my mind is unable to link into the group mind to prove my worth to the folk. I have made it my mission to make peace between the folk and the dark spiders. Why do you want peace with the spiders? The spiders have much to trade that would benefit the folk. I don't believe they want to hurt the folk. The ancients must have put a curse on all who live in Undermountain. The curse makes the spiders attack. What is the curse of the ancients? The ancients who made the castle were evil people. I believe they cursed all the folk of Undermountain, intending the dark spiders, including the dark spiders. That's the cause of the recent violence. Why do you think Undermountain is cursed? I saw a member of the first mine home enter the cavern of the ancients and get torn apart by its guardians. I also overheard guards from the castle whispering about a curse that inflicted them that afflict them. Perhaps we could help each other. That's a wonderful idea. If you end the curse of the ancients, I will make you a piece of silk armor. I'll also help you up the cliff and make sure you're allowed into Darkhold. I pledge to end the curse for you. Let's go to the cliff now. Excellent. The best place to climb the cliff is over here. It's the only place to climb the cliff. Climb the cliff? Yes. What are you doing? I'm trying to get to the castle. Please, I have no quarrel with you. I don't care who you are. I'll let you pass, but any hostility will mean your death. Do you swear not to bother any of the spiders in this area? Yes. Here, let me spin you a talisman. Still, you must visit the queen on the northwest side of Darkhold. She will be highly displeased to find you wandering about through it without her permission. Whatever you do, though, avoid the fungus groves. Okay, is there anything else you need? Um, thanks for your help. Goodbye. Alright, we want to go up that way and miss the red mark and punch the wall and fight the red slod. That's jank.
There we go. Now we need all of these necklaces. They're a secret tool that we'll need for later. And we need the box. Put the talisman on. Get that out of here. We don't need that garbage. Or that garbage. Or that garbage. We want to keep this garbage though. What kind of arrows are these? Plus two. We need to put them in the arrows box. So we've got six plus two, four plus one, and eight plus three. Okay, now. Oh man, I didn't put it in the standing stone. Minute Meteors, I already have that spell. Nagi's Journal. Um, written by a sorcerer named Nagi, the journal is yellowed with age. You can you scan the first line of several entries. Tar's evil attracted the enemy. Worse still, the entity was possessed the fungus I summoned and is able to stay on this plane. My one solace is that the fungus attacks Tar as readily as me. I've learned so much. The retreat into the caves beneath the castle was a wise decision. My followers and I discovered powerful Sodomania magics will soon be strong enough to reclaim the castle. The inner eye has been broken. My sister Tara is too hungry for power and demands I submit to her whims. Never! It is I who should rule the inner eye. I swear, Tara will be defeated. I found a way to summon the creature immune to her spells, an animate fungus. Now that feckless witch will know my wrath, but not my mercy. My talismans are a boon twice over. Not only do they blind the fungus to our presence, but the entity seems to actually shrink from it. A more powerful necklace will certainly rid us of the entity. Entombed alive, I would gladly die, but not like this. I am drained of my powers and too weak to do t to so much as break bread. Ignoble end. I will find a way to gather my strength and avenge my disgrace. The golden star pendant is finished. As soon as it, as soon as its rune forged metal has cooled, my followers will use it to seal the entity deep in the mountain's heart. I will breathe easier with that menace gone. My death is near, nothing left to eat and too weak to care. I have one last thing to do, a parting gift for my sister. My last breath shall chill Tara's very bones. My bid to lead the inner eye failed. Balked by my own dear sister, she will pay for her treachery. I swear it, I was blind to trust her. Should have known she could coveted the leadership when she urged me to wait. I'd like to see the prince. He's not here now, but Queen uh, grant you audience. Welcome to my realm. I am Queen Chick Chi Smack Tuck and you look like strong people and I require warriors. Attend and I will tell you what I want. What can I do for you? An entity in the South Fungus Grove takes over the minds of my subjects whenever they get close to it. 
it must be destroyed. If you can release the, the enslaved spiders as well, all the better. I will destroy the entity for you. Excellent. Hello, brave warriors. I'm Prince Clicktuck, and I heard you speak speaking of my mother, and I must warn you not to trust her. She plots your death. She is only interested in securing absolute power over all who live in Undermountain and will toss you aside as soon as your usefulness is over. I'm very sure the outcast told you that I saw I'm trustworthy. I will help you overthrow the queen. I'll start immediately. So let's come over here. Put our anti fungi medicine up. All right, um, did I put the necklace on? Yes, I did. Okay. Mantis Queen goes first. Nope, we're not done yet. We're... Did I put the key pendant? There it is. We take the golden pendant. What do you mean, no line of sight? Dang it. In turn. In turn. There we go. What happened? What am I doing here? Your mind was controlled by the fungus. Controlled? The fungus have always been harmless. The folk even eat the stuff. How could we be controlled by it? Um, an entity controlled the fungus. Do you want us to follow you? Yes. Alright, right here, I'm going to save, and I'm going to quit, and that's going to be the end of the episode. 
Um, there is a game breaking glitch that may come up at the beginning of episode 5. We'll see what happens.